Hello everybody and welcome. My name is Table of Wood. This is my very first video of Let's Play on Star Wars The Old Republic. So today I just decided I will start up a new character which is gonna be a Chiss Imperial Agent. I've never done the Imperial Agent story so I'll be starting fresh with you guys. So just check out the video right now. That's my guy, just coming in. And they start up on the same planet as the Bunty Hunters, which is Hata. The uh, planets which the Hot make their own. Security seems tight on <laughs> Hata. I didn't make uh, my character too bulky since it's an Imperial agent. You have to be a little bit smaller and you know, it's more of an agile kind of character. I have other characters which are bigger and it would look well, it looks like it's gonna be a little bit like my bunty on, uh, not bunty on but I mean smuggler I have on the Republic side. Secure transmission established. This is Keeper. We may speak freely, Agent. Prepare to receive your orders. Perfect. So I won't speak too much while the character is speaking and we're in star mission and stuff. So we'll, we'll be able to hear what the uh, other guys and my character is saying. So let's say, yes, I understood. I'm ready, sir. What's the assignment? In short, subversion. You were chosen for this operation because of your exemplary performance during training. Imperial intelligence needs agents capable of working independently in the field. Now you apply your training to the real world. Nemro the Hutt and his organization run Jaguna, and you're in town to convince Nemro to supply the Empire. Okay, got it. Uh, maybe want more details about that. Give me background. What are we working from? Daguna is an industrial town and Nemro runs most of the industry. The hut applies weapons, drugs and raw materials. But not to us. We believe Nemro has been reluctant to lose Republic customers by publicly siding with the Empire. It's time he overcame this reluctance. I agree. You're absolutely right. We need to know what Nemro and his advisors are thinking before we can act. I want you to obtain access to the Nemro clan's inner circle. You require a covered identity. One of our contacts, an alien named G, has prepared a background for you and will provide the details. How do I find him? G will be waiting for you at a safe house. Locate him, take what he offers, then report to me. Alrighty then. Consider it done. Most of Jaguna is caught up in a turf war. Some of the gangs involved belong to the huts. Others are independent. Your combat training should see you through, but expect brutality I'll and see expect that. to be targeted. Jaguna isn't friendly to strangers. Now, find G and report back to me. Keep her out. So, it starts well because it seems to be uh, some undercover missions. Just gonna put up the uh, interface as I usually play, so I already make my extended with details. As you can see here, I got my bars on both sides, and I got the information. Text is right at 40 HP, and as well for in, in this case energy. So I'm just gonna move that here, activate it. Sprint wasn't in the game at level one before, but since with all the patches, and if the you're playing Swotors for at least a few months it's been there for level one that is my buff and if I cast it you'll see I have another one that pops up mark of power that's just because my sit inquisitor have passed a few of his uh, chapters I think chapter two when you pass through chapter two of your story you will unlock abilities through your legacy and this guy is inside my legacy which is called the butt scratcher legacy uh, I'm a fan of Family Guy, so I just found that funny. So, if you don't mind about that, 
little point over there. So I'm just gonna place place everything here. Um, okay, good recovery. Perfect. So just see, I got covers. It's pretty much the same mechanics as a smuggler. If I can see here, I'll just zoom out of the minimap to see where I need to go. Okay, we have two quests to pick up. Let's talk to that robot first. Hello, Mr. Roboto. Uh, okay, Nemro says they got a message. I can spare a minute. That's a fatty hut. Well, sounds like a kind of my job. I'll see I what can I can do. do. Sure, Mr. Robot, sure. Okay, and the uh, other guy here wants to talk to us. Yeah, so, if you never played Star Wars The Old Republic before, as you can see, this is the quest marker on the top of this character here. And this woman over here is not available yet so this quest is not available for level yes uh, yet so we'll be able maybe level two or later on so let's get that one mr. Liu Brill welcome to Hada kid you're new here you look like you got a bright future so let me give you a word of advice watch your back out there learn how to please the people in charge and as soon as you can get out oh I don't, don't worry about me any longer than I have to got a good head on you then. Just hope that when you're ready to leave, you still can. There's a gang war raging out there right now. If you want to survive on Hutta, you're gonna have to learn the ropes. Okay. I can get you experience navigating Hutta's gangs. Help you build your reputation. If you help me out. Mm. Well, you have my now attention. Now you're finally saying something interesting. This is a gangster town, controlled by a greedy and cruel hut named Nemro. As if there was any other kind. Used to be I worked for Nemro's gang. Violent, bloody life. That's why I left. But now, my little brother's following my footsteps. Oh no. Nemro's street gang leader, Rex Gear, is my old buddy. I thought he might help get my brother out. But I can't get to Rex for all the fighting. Well, they won't stop me. I'm good at getting in places I don't belong. That's what I like to hear. You'll find Nemro's boys holed up in Jaguna, but you're gonna need to fight through Fathra's thugs, so be careful. Oh, I will. Okay, time for some action. Uh, okay, so that that is a binding point where you can teleport to use quick travels, and this one's already unlocked, so I don't have to click on it, but if I ever find another one, I will have to. In that case, this is... a I can call it a fly pad. It used to play a while in the first time. So this is a transport or a travel we are not point. Responsible for missed departures. So just unlock it by clicking on it. If you see the icon on the top with a circle around it, that means you have to unlock it. If you forget about it, you won't be able to use it. So I see here some action and if you ever or me never played Swotor, uh, you maybe don't know why there's a green character here. This is the cover system when you're playing either the Imperial Agent or the Smuggler, which in cover gives you another bar, the cover bars here, and I can put different skills inside of it. So for example, right now I'm gonna put a grenade on him and make him explode, then do a snipe shot, shoot him, and another snipe shot, and there we go. Thing to know and really important in Swotor is that there is no auto attack, so each time you have to press on the key you want to attack. So either the key number one here for my normal attack, or I can right click on the enemy itself. Come on, you dodged that. Okay. So if I look on the map here, it says defeat six of the Fatras gangsters. 
I'll think that would be the last one. Uh, there's another one hidden right here. So let's kill them as well. That's good. And let's get inside of this place. I need to speak uh, with Rex Gear. Mr. Gear. You got some skill breaking through Fathra's line and some nerve coming in here. Do I know you? Uh, let's make this quick. I don't have time for this. I'm here for the Brel kid. What do you want with him? You working for Fathra too? Oh, no, I'm not. I work for the His kid's family. Sent me to get him out of the gang. Who sent you, huh? I wish I could say that made things different, but it uh, just don't work that way. The Brel kid's a traitor. First time Father's thug starts shooting at us, he turns coward and tries to join their side. Nemro's gonna have a lot of questions for him, and I can't let him go. I think we can work out a deal. You're right. We're civilized people, aren't we? Look, I don't want to make trouble. So how about I pay you some credits and you go on your way? Tell Brel's big brother you got here too late or something. You'll be richer. So here is a good example of what Swooter offers uh, is the light side dark side choice. So I can pick up the money and just let the kid die or so whatever is going to happen to him. Or I can just say no and free him. And for this instance I think I will play a light side Imperial Agent since I have a bounty hunter that is on the dark side and an Inquisitor that is on the dark side. And a Sith Juggernaut that is on the dark side as well. So let's make difference this time and make it light side. I have a better idea. You let Brel go. He and his brother leave Hutter for good. And nobody knows any different. What am I supposed to tell the boys? Turn coward and get a free pass off Hutter? That kind of deal's no good for morale. Yeah. You work with me, or I shoot you in the face. All right, <laughs> kind of radical. Right. Looks like you got lucky, Brill. Your big brother's hired muscle just saved your skin. Thank you. My pleasure. You better get out of here, too. The boys won't be happy when they find out what you did. Well, that will be your problem, mister. Okay, next place seems to be right here. Oh, that's my own mission. Oh, yeah. Here it's gonna be a complete mission if you didn't have the access to it while well, we are, you were in combat or you were in, in a conversation while you completed the mission. You won't see it, so you can press on that pending and just absent. And we go level 2. Nice. So just gonna talk to that guy quickly. And then I'll have to cut off the video. And we'll see each other on the next video. Because uh, we do have a limit of 15 minutes each. I'll be This is gonna be part 1. I'll see you on the next video. So I'm just I'm gonna start the conversation on the next one. I'm really short on time. So see you on the next video. Thank you all. Bye bye.